Hi Aquarius, this is going to be your reading for the 3rd until the 9th of February. So check your moon, Venus and Rising if the messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insight. And this month I'm giving away two decks, the Romance Angels or the Psychic Tarot. You can comment and let me know which one you'd like to win. Pick in two winners. So by commenting you've entered. Messages for Aquarius. Solitude. All right, Aquarius, the third until the ninth of February. Three of Pentacles. Let's see. Tower. You are taking your time. You may have, some of you may have met someone who you feel could be the one. Someone you feel like you could take it slow with and you know go far with, settle down with. Here is a tower. So this person may have come out of nowhere. It could have been, some of you could have had an event, a life-changing event recently. The Seven of Cups is how you've seen them, so very, you know, fairy tale like situation for some of you. Fantasizing. Okay, you might be dealing with someone who is very, very serious. Their feelings for you right now, this could be an air sign, um, air, not Aries. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, like yourself, but they may um, be very uh, slightly detached by nature, where they just, they don't show feelings like that much. Some of you deal with someone who doesn't show feelings too easily, but they do want family. They do want a relationship. They want to move forward. If you haven't if you have a family already, they do want to be in this marriage. And they're seeing you as the empress. What better card than someone seeing you as the empress? Because that means, you know, they see you as gorgeous, that you're attractive. Best card for that placement. And then here, the four of pentacles. So you may both end up holding back. And it may be because of them holding back, so you may hold back because you may feel, you know, not ready to leave if they're not ready to leave. But secretly they want this relationship, they, they are very attracted to you. Just on the feelings part, they may be very, you know, they don't show feelings that easily or, that, or too soon. The sun... So things are going to be great regardless of this guy here. This is just their tough exterior, okay? Because what they really want is just to be in a relationship. Why is the tower here? Okay. You may have finally met that person who you feel like you can trust, some of you. A moment where you don't have to wait anymore. Everything is fair. Everything's balanced. Some of you are dealing with a Libra. Or someone with Libra in the chart. Just the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. 
Yeah, you're not about to take a leap. Some of you are not taking a leap. You're staying strong, possibly dealing with Leo, some of you as well, or in the chart. You do see this person as, you know, amazing and everything, but you're taking it slow because some of you, you know, they see in this person as taking it slow. They're not showing feelings, so you're not leaping either. There's no, no one's taking a risk here, but you both want the same things. Why is the Seven of Cups here? You may fantasize about this person at work or whatever you're doing throughout the day. But um, they may be hardworking and very chill, very laid back, hardworking, serious. You know, a provider for the females. The Ten of Cups. Where's the Ten of Cups here? The Page of Swords. Okay. Hold on. They do want a family. But they are as well um, cautious. Especially when it comes to feelings, someone is very air sign-like, you know, not showing feelings. Some of you, they may come out and say that they want a relationship eventually, or if they haven't already. But there is like a slight caution with them. Okay, this came out, Five of Swords. Some of you feel like, okay, with the Five of Swords that came out, you are standing your ground, like not allowing yourself to fall in love so easily this time. Okay, let's see what they really feel. But yeah. They may have been cheated on in the past. This person may have been cheated on in the past. This is why they're so stone-faced, they're so um, serious. They have this wall up because here, you know, we have an affair that happened in the past and their past relationship had them heartbroken. So now they're really cautious and you may be the same way. You may be cautious as well. So the Empress. This is what they like about you. The mystery and the power that you have over them. They feel like, you know, you have a power over them and you have a strong connection with the Two of Cups and on top of all of that, you're highly attractive. So that's even better. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Need attachment, you both, you both on guard. Yeah, hold on. Four of Pentacles. Both on guard, both burdened by your past. You both need to find this solitude. You both need to um, eventually have a talk about both of you's issues in the past because you're both on the same page not even knowing that you're on the same page have the same similar history why is the sun here okay for this week you, you're both going to continue to feel this, like, this wall up, this not being able to trust. It may even slow down communication for a bit. Let's see. Okay. Keeping... Ooh. 
Hold on. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual types, and maybe you're not used to this serious type of person, this person who has a wall up. But this may be the best person for you, especially if you know you've both been through the same things. You both understand each other in the future. Just not right now, because it looks like you're both really hiding, hiding from each other when it comes to feelings. Okay, messages for Aquarius. New love, a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Some of you may have not even met this person yet. Playfulness to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. So basically, you both need to calm down, like take the wall down a bit. Deception, someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship, see? They're wearing a mask of this toughness, you know, like not showing feelings. When really this is how they feel, like inside they're this broken little boy or girl who was, you know, betrayed in the past and hurt. I may have to wear this mask of um, seriousness, this wall to protect themselves. My priestess, you have divine knowledge that can help others through their spiritual teaching. Prosperity, the universe is pouring out its abundance to you. Be open to receiving. Past life, this is this situation involves past life memories. Medicine woman, you are a channel for divine healing power. There is need there is healing that needs to go on here. Let's see. Messages for Aquarius. Harmony. This is your soul, both of your souls together. Harmony. But on the outside, in this material world, in this uh, physical world, you don't know. Like, both of you don't know what's going on inside. Your souls are connecting, but on the outside, you've got all this doubt. Hope. There is hope. This is just for Aquarius. Destinies. This is your destiny and awareness. So, you guys are just not aware, but you will be soon. You will soon come become aware of the connection that you have. Um, when you both find out that you're actually both coming from the same place and that this is your destiny, especially being a past life relationship. Oh, I heard someone talking. Yeah, this being a past life relationship is definitely your destiny. And there's hope and there's harmony. It just there's this wall that you have. You both have this wall up. And. I feel like you only have the wall up because you see that they do, so you're not ready to leap, although you want to. You're being strong, you're not falling um, head over heels like you would usually, or did in the past. You know, this partnership is, at the moment, very friend-like, a little bit more than friends, but there's this wall that keeps it at that vibe that friend vibe where you're attracted to each other but um the feelings are are stagnant right now because of the past issues okay so for this week you won't get past that at least not for the for next few days and so you have a talk but at least you you understand what's going on here now so that you no longer have to feel 
afraid that they that they don't have feelings or that they're not showing feelings yet. At least you know that they have issues that they have going on. So I guess once you guys finally get to know each other and talk, you will realize that you have a really strong connection. Okay. So yep, Aquarius. This was your reading for the 3rd until the 9th of January, not January, February. Check your moon, Venus, and rising if the messages don't resonate or if you would like more insight on your week. And if you'd like to be one of two winners, leave a comment. Let me know if you'd like to win, whether you'd like to win the Romance Angels or the Psychic Tarot by commenting you've entered. So... Like this video if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already and thanks for watching.